Good morning. Welcome to another episode of Fish Bait. There's my trusted assisted Michael, Fish Bait Jr. And we are going to be talking today about cleaning a filter. Okay, now we have a bead filter hooked up to our koi pond. And what we're going to do is we're going to show you how easy it is to flush our Sacramento koi bead filter. All right, so the first thing we do is we hook up a line, all right, and that line's going to pour into our fish or into our flower beds. Now, I realize we haven't weeded our flower bed in a long time. Once this is weeded, you will see the beauty of all the flowers we have in here. But we really haven't had a chance to uh, weed our flower bed this summer. So right now, if you take a look at our filter, our filter is set on the filter setting. So the first thing we do is we come over and we shut off our pump. We're then going to move it to backwash. And then we're going to turn the pump back on for about five seconds. What that does is then that provides a little bit of space in the filter for air. We're then going to turn the valve, which we just did on the side for the blower. And then we turn the, the valve to rinse on our multi-port valve, and then we turn on our blower. As you can see, the beads are now being agitated, and it's pushing water. This is all the fish waste that is now coming out of the uh, of the uh, the bead filter. Follow the line back, and we let that run for about 45 seconds. You can see it's tossing up all the media. After 45 seconds, you then go over to the multi-port valve head and turn it to backwash. And you look at how dirty the water is that's coming out. That's all fish waste that's coming out. Now, we're getting to the point where it's to the bottom. Then we're going to take our... And we shut off the pump. Very important that you close that air valve right there. Otherwise, water is going to get up into your blower. Then you turn back on the pump. The pump starts blowing the water. Follow it out. And then you can see you rinse until about clear. Come back, turn the pump off, turn it to rinse. You'll notice it'll start pushing the water back up through and this is going to rinse all of the dirty water out of your pond or out of your bead filter as it comes up. It fills back up. You can see that it's flowing. It comes out. And you do this until your water is clear again. We repeat this process twice a day until our water is clear. 